This is the day that the Lord has made, and let us rejoice and be glad in it. 1 Corinthians chapter 13 sums up love. It reads, If I speak with the tongues of men and of angels, but do not have love, I have become a noisy gong or a clanging cymbal. If I have the gift of prophecy and know all mysteries and all knowledge, if I have all faith so as to remove mountains, but do not have love, I am nothing. And if I give all my possessions to feed the poor, and if I surrender my body to be burned, but do not have love, it profits me nothing. Love is patient, love is kind, and is not jealous. Love does not brag and is not arrogant, does not act unbecomingly, does not seek its own, is not provoked, does not take into account a wrong suffered, does not rejoice in unrighteousness, but rejoices with the truth, bears all things, believes all things, hopes all things, endures all things. Love never fails, but if they are gifts of prophecy, they will be done away. If they are tongues, they will cease. If there is knowledge, it will be done away. For we know in part, and we prophesy in part. But when the perfect comes, the partial will be done away. When I was a child, I used to speak like a child, think like a child, reason like a child. When I became a man, I did away with childish things. For now, we see in a mirror dimly, but then face to face. Now I know in part, but then I will know fully just as I also have been fully known. But now faith, hope, love abides these three, but the greatest of these is love. Today, let's turn away from hate. Let's turn away from ruckus. Let's turn away from negativity. Let's turn toward love because love never fails. Father God, we thank you, Lord, once again for allowing us to come to you in prayer. Father God, we don't take this privilege lightly because things can be different. So, Father God, as we come to you, thanking you for today, and as we ask for the forgiveness of sin, we pray, Father God, for this nation. Father God, we know we're not the only nation on this earth, but this is the piece of land we live on. We pray, Father God, you keep the villains at bay. Allow your people to show love despite what may be seen in the media or heard on the internet. We ask Father God that today, this one day, your people will show your love, your compassion, the gifts that you have given them to bring people closer to where they need to be. And that place is with you. We thank you. In the matchless name of Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen. Amen.